the breaking story. Our nonstop news crew first broke yesterday morning. Now police want your help finding the shooters. CBS 2's Mugo Digway live with these brand new pictures this morning. Mugo. Yeah, good morning. We know for sure that Yvonne Rusich was just so clearly loved. We noticed that yesterday morning in Egwish and really just throughout the day. We drove by the neighborhood this morning and some memorial balloons and candles are still standing out there in memory of this woman. Meantime, police here are trying to find her killer. So they released these surveillance photos. This was early this morning, and we know it's still very hard to make out who these suspects are because much of their faces are covered. But the one on the left is wearing all black, including a black face mask. The second is wearing white with black shoes and a light colored face mask. You can clearly see that both of them are pointing a gun. Now, here's video of that shooting. This was around 430 yesterday morning. It shows Yvonne parked, getting ready to go into work. She's talking to one of her sons through through the window of his car when another car pulls up two people walk out and start shooting at her we're pausing that video early while Yvonne's son was able to drive off she accelerated down the street and crashed a witness says the men came back and shot her again you should be ashamed of yourself and anybody who's hiding your dirty little secret right now should be ashamed of themselves too so right now, a $2,000 reward has been put up for any information leading to an arrest. Police are also asking people in the neighborhood to check your surveillance video for any video that may be connected to this case. We're live at Area South Police Station. Mugul Deepway, CBS 2 News.